Hey guys, today we're going to be talking about what to expect when you get on a plane during COVID. So if you haven't been here before, my name is Keshvi and in this series we talk about flying during the pandemic. And if that seems like something you're interested in, hit that subscribe button and press that bell so that you get notified every time I post. If you are looking for more of a vlog style video, go find my vlog about flying in 2020 just up here. And I'll also link it in the description below. So this video in particular is gonna be mainly about Air Canada as during the pandemic, I have actually taken two Air Canada flights. As I said in my last video about the airports, which if you haven't watched yet, I'm gonna link just up here for you guys and in the description. Flying is so different now than it was before 2020. So let me talk you through all the things that you need to expect when getting on a plane in 2021. So let's start with boarding the plane. Previous to COVID, they did actually used to call us up in groups. This is definitely still something that they do. And you'll find now that there are gonna be less people in each group. Even though they don't have the dots on the floor like they do in other parts of the airport, they actually do still tell you when lining up to make sure that you stay two meters apart and keep your masks on. When I flew in July 2020, even though they had these processes in place, people were still queuing very, very closely to each other. But now people actually do stay six feet apart when queuing for the aeroplane. As you can see, the terminal that I was in was pretty empty and there weren't that many people on my flight. And this is to be expected right now because people are not being encouraged to travel. So once you get on the flight, everyone is actually very evenly spaced out, but you can choose to move if you like to only after the plane has taken off. I didn't really feel the need to because as you can see, I actually got a whole road to myself. So why would I leave? <laughs> However, there was somebody sitting in front of me and someone sitting behind me. So if I did feel unsafe because of that, I could have moved. Everything seemed sanitized once on board. All of the pillows, blankets, etc., were all in sealed plastic bags, so I knew that nobody had touched them before me. You also get a sanitizing bag when you get on the flight. We have a mask. So I look at the light little goodie bag on there. Headphones. Ooh, pencils. This book. Oh my god, this way it's gonna be more UK food, isn't it? Amazing. Oh yeah. Hand job. This is a pretty nice hand job actually. It's a very cute ball. Uh, I like that. During the whole flight, all flight attendants are wearing protective gear, including masks and gloves. And when they're serving food, a lot of them do wear their overalls and a face shield as well. Us as passengers are expected to wear our masks the entire flight. You are able to change your mask during your flight and the only time you can take your mask off is when you're eating. I said in one of my previous videos that you definitely should take a change of masks. And if you haven't seen that video, I'm gonna link it in the description below. I talk about everything that you need before you actually fly. The other thing that you do need to remember is to take a mask that you're comfortable in because you do have to wear it while you're sleeping as well. I just did a 10 hour flight and I wore a mask the entire time. The other thing that they do at Air Canada, which I'm sure is similar in other flights, is they will always give you a new mask if you ask for one. They don't, however, come through the cabin as often as they used to, but if you do press the call button, they will come to you as soon as they possibly can. Now, when I got on my flight to Canada, we had a um, dinner meal and a morning meal. And the dinner meal last time was literally just like a sandwich and a couple of snacks. But now they have actually created more of a meal for you to have while on this flight. Even though it is still cold, it is definitely more filling and you actually get alcohol with your meal now. I don't mind this time. This time, last time I was in a, in a plane they weren't serving alcohol, they were just doing water, so like, that's Maybe. Oh, I haven't got a coffee this time, so let's see what it looks like. I don't know what it is. I think it's because I want to have it. And then we've got some chocolate. 
So in terms of breakfast, I would say the breakfast that I had in my flight in July and the breakfast that I had in my flight in January are pretty much exactly the same. Uh, they still don't serve hot breakfasts, but they do give you an option of tea, coffee or a juice for your breakfast drink. So lastly, let's talk about getting off the flight. As you saw, when I got off the flight in July 2020, there was no distancing socially or otherwise <laughs> but now because there are less people on the flight and people are more aware that they do need to give people space there is way more social distancing the staff themselves actually aren't implementing anything in terms of social distancing when you get off the flight however most members of the public do understand the necessity for keeping six feet apart and so just do that automatically anyway. Overall, I was pretty happy with my experience on the flight. Air Canada have done a great job of making sure that everyone keeps their masks on and are staying safe during the flight. I'm so happy that they still come around with water and they've now started serving alcohol during the flights too. So that's all I have for you guys about the flights. Um, let me know if you enjoyed this video. Give it a big thumbs up if you did. Give it a big thumbs up if you didn't. I really hope that you found it helpful. Let me know in the comments below what surprised you the most about being on a flight in 2021. And I hope you guys have a great, great day. I would love to see you guys again. Travel safe and stay happy. Love from Keshvi. All flight attendants. Yeah, I don't know. I'll use one of them in it. Our masks. Oh, God. For food. Uh, or at... Mm-hmm.